Hello Collective, welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families as always. I return to source, I return to sender all negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in only the purest of white light and pray that you stay only in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy has stolen from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of the enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Let's go ahead and get into our tarot reading. Uh, so someone is trying to keep a queen of cups from having wish fulfillment, ultimate fulfillment in life. Uh, there may be people or someone behind the scenes still plotting against you, pl uh, plotting to take you out for the you and someone do not meet. They may also be trying to temper with your work, destroy your work so that you do not flourish in life. They don't want you having any type of uh, abundance, uh, stability, security, any type of fulfillment. This could be someone from your past that has linked up with a group of other people to take you down. Um, and this is all based on a false narrative. Um, it's been people out here that have gotten together to destroy and end you all based off of a lie, off of jealousy, greed, anything you can think of, okay? So someone was plotting to take you out uh, a block something for you. And as you can see, excuse me, as you can see, your ancestors interfere with whatever it is they were doing. Lord have mercy. There's something supernatural that's going on out right here. A lot of you, a lot of you may not be even aware that this is going on because your ancestors and angels are protecting you. But there is some type of divine intervention taking place. Um, so whatever, either like a group or community or whatever, whoever institution was plotting to do to you, your ancestors stepped in. This is like divine intervention, right? When you need it. Of course, it's not planned by us, but our ancestors, the universe, they all know what's going on. So whatever is being blocked, whatever you're being protected from is by all means of your ancestors. There is something out here where it's like a group is being unrealistic. Someone may have received some type of bad news, bad communication. Maybe they were expecting to hear that you have been blocked, you have been stopped, whatever you were supposed to receive. It's not coming towards you, but someone received some type of bad news that you are still moving forward. Um, what I'm hearing is that there's someone behind the scenes trying to destroy someone, dismantle someone. So if you're someone that's very strong with a lot of tenacity, you tend to just focus on yourself, what it is ahead of you, what is in front of you, excuse me, your family, friend, and all of that. There's someone behind the scenes that has a problem with that. You may have an ex that does not want you to be happy, does not want you to have wish fulfillment. Some of you may have had an ex. You're a queen of pentacles and you're moving forward in victory and this is helping you defeat your enemies. You may have an ex out here that is maybe wanting to come back in your life, not because they love you, not because they have any type of genuine emotions for you, but it's solely based on the fact that they don't want you thriving in life. And whoever you are supposed to be with, um, it, their partner, so it's like two bitter exes doing the same thing, but you two are experiencing it on your side of the world. So if you're supposed to come together with someone, um, his ex or her ex is uh, behind the scenes causing them problems, I'm telling you, causing them problems so that they do not move on with their life and give uh, and give or have a commitment with someone else, okay? Someone was hoping that they can keep something or control something. You could have a masculine behind the scenes that's been trying to control a queen of cups in the upright, trying to keep something from you. They don't want you partnering up with anyone because someone has been out here telling a whole lot of lies. Someone does not want you to have a new beginning, taking a different route, a new path in life. Um, so they've been out here just doing a lot of malicious things to make sure that you don't get any offers. You are isolated. Someone may want to come into your life and trap you uh, so that you don't receive your ears of pentacles. There could be like a plot where there are a group of people trying to set something up where it's that you go somewhere and then you end up meeting someone that you probably don't want to be with or someone you're not supposed to be with, like end up in some type of toxic connection with someone you have no business interacting with. Um, so this is something a group may be planning behind the scenes, maybe like a king of swords and his people. Yeah, this is a plot, something they're planning to have you go somewhere so that someone can surprise you, but it's going to be a disappointment because it's a no from the universe. Um, they want 
to be able to keep you trapped in some type of old paradigm where you're just confused all over the place. You're isolated, rejected, and things like that. There's another Queen of Cups in this situation, and she's going through the same thing. This is someone that does a lot of manipulations. Someone knows that they're headed uh, kind of through that dark night of the soul and headed right for uh, some type of tower by the hands of the Most High. So someone is basically going through karma in order for something to be balanced. Someone may have stolen something from you in the past and it has been taken from them. Whether this was like a commitment, a job offer, maybe they built something off of the back of you pretending to be in the upright. But this is someone that just uh, is very malicious. They get a thrill out of manipulating people, uh, just playing a lot of mind games. Someone may, someone may be going through a lot of emotions because everything they've been doing has caught up to them. Yes, yeah, someone is definitely stuck in their mind, going through a lot of conflict, feeling disappointed, maybe throwing some type of temper tantrum behind the scenes. There's a lot of fighting, arguing, cursing, yelling, all kinds of stuff going on behind the scenes. These people may even be in competition with you for your destiny. And of course, you know when your destiny, your destiny is yours. It, it, no one is going to have that. That's not how the Most High has it set, has it set up. But these people are fighting about two people coming together, healing together, having genuine love. They don't want you to reconnecting is what I'm hearing. So this could be someone you know from the past. And I don't mean like you dating. This could just be someone that you may have interacted with before. Um, and... These people are working really hard to get the masculine to move on, go back into a toxic relationship. They're working really hard for you to go back into a toxic relationship as well. So they're doing any and everything to make sure that you and this person do not come together. There could be, I mean, there's a tower going on behind the scenes. You may not be aware of it. It could be a king of swords going through some type of tower behind the scenes. And this is karma because of something he may have done. And I'm not talking about the king of swords in the upright. I'm talking about some Someone that's very dark, does a lot of illusions, has been out here invading people's privacy, monitoring people illegally and things like that, and uh, still goes out every day and pretends to be a pillar of the community, but the whole time this is his real energy. Uh, so the universe is about to mirror his energy. They're about to match his vibes. Uh, and someone may be living in fear because they know what's about to happen to them. Someone is about to lose everything because they tried to tick or they may have taken everything from someone else. He may have plotted someone else's demise. Yeah, someone is about to be exposed. Uh, this uh, uh, family going through exposure some type of court case. If there is a court case going on, they're going to lose this court case. This could be a couple as well. Maybe this is a, this was a couple that's been out here pretending to be in the upright and they're being seen for who they are. These are people that are very uh, malicious, very uh, undependable. They may be going through some type of uh, setback in life. Um, maybe their confidence is not where it used to be. Maybe these were two people that are very much in, uh, confident in their manipulative tactics and things like that. They were able to manipulate people around them to get them to uh, participate in something that just was unholy, unorthodox, not based on principle. But two people are very good at manipulating other people. And there may have been a group that was working with these people to take someone else down or to block um, two people just from having some type of collaboration or get together. It could be in love, in business, whatever it is, but in divine timing, whoever you are supposed to be with collective, they will connect with you um, in however way the universe has destined it to happen. I wouldn't hurt my head about it. You know, when people are going through this much trouble to block you from achieving or getting somewhere, you know you're a powerhouse. So you should feel honor. You should feel privileged that these people will take time out of their lives to come and try to hinder you whole time your ancestors are watching them. These people are under judgment. Um, your ancestors are protecting your new beginning as well. You answered your call and things like that. There may be someone here as well that is going to be uh, going back into the dream world. Um, it's that kind of some type of karma going on. So while as they were planning your demise, Someone is about to pass away and will be returning to the spirit realm. And hopefully they can get enough sleep and we'll have to do this rodeo again. I'm telling you, someone will be passing away. Oh yeah, absolutely. A hundred percent. Someone is passing away. Someone could be in a coma right now. Um, whoever was like the grab your pitchforks, grab your swords, your whatever. 
uh, he the head of that squad, they're passing away. Someone is about to lose everything as well. There's an empress energy in a community that's about to head right to poverty. Um, maybe she's been working with a king of swords behind the scenes to hinder your forward movement. This could be someone's mother, someone's wife. If it is someone's mother, she's been working to make sure either her daughter gets some type of opportunity or gets her daughter and a masculine to stay in a relationship that the masculine is not happy in. Uh, so this mother has been doing a lot behind the scenes to make sure that a masculine does not move on with his life. If this is a wife, this is a wife just making sure that her husband stays miserable with her. She's like, if I can't have wish fulfillment with him, nobody can have it. So she may even be plotting to take this man out, but it's not going to go according to plan because two people will still be getting together and having this wish fulfillment, this new beginning um, in life. And if they're going to have a lot of off options and a lot, of, a lot of opportunities coming towards them. They're going to be building something. People are, two people are about to be very abundant, excuse me, in life, okay? And it's going to be a lot of genuine love and it's going to be based on friendship. Someone will be communicating with you in however way. They may have to get crafty with how, with how they communicate with you. This could be someone that's in his King of Cups energy for you, but I don't think this is someone that's in their King of Cups energy anymore naturally because there's something that has happened where it's like this man has had to get into his kink of source energy to stay vigilant around the people that are in about the people that are interacting with him to stay vigilant in his uh environment because there are possibly people around this masculine that has been trying to take him out or just block his forward movement trying to steal something from him maybe try to even break into his home something like that um so this man is in his kink of source energy right now trying to protect himself and by all means you know what we are here for that energy sir do exactly what it is you need to do to protect yourself but when it comes to you this is someone that is in his king of cups energy he has a lot of emotions for you and this is why why these people are so pissed off because there's a lot of jealousy um you may not even know these people and the whole time you've had a whole community trying to destroy you meanwhile you're out here just kind of focused on your life if you have children taking care of your children i said children in the um deck split on the page of wands so that you could have children maybe you're just in your single life minding your business elevating in your way you know talking to your crystals your ancestors drinking your green juices meditating doing whatever it is you need to do to you know take care of yourself um but these people have been really gung-ho on working together to take you out but your ancestors are ensuring your victory as you can see here your ancestors have a plan to make sure that someone gets out of a karmic situation you may end up relocating maybe you're going to go on vacation go to some type of uh location maybe you may end up falling in love with that place and decide to stay there or something but your ancestors are all over this situation and i don't know what it is these people thought they were doing there's something some type of illusion delusion that people think they have some type of control over what it is they can do in other people's life you are not in charge of anybody's destiny anybody's life you are only in charge of your pathway your destiny so you can't change anyone else's destiny so you can entertain the universe as long as you want to or actually as long as as long as they let you but things will always be balanced out i'm telling you things will always be balanced out they will always step in at the right time to balance something out so someone or a group or a couple who have been on their way or actively doing something to take someone out and as you can see there was some type of supernatural intervention that took place and now it has someone burdened and weighed down because now they don't even know how to proceed with coming in to give an offer as well because there was someone that was planning to come in with some type of frivolous offer in order to keep you trapped in some type of situation but your ancestors are blocking that to make sure you have your victory make sure to show gratitude to your ancestors because oftentimes that's really what you need to do in order to co-create with the universe go within have some alone time reflect on your life on your path uh pay attention to what signs symbols and you know other revelations that are being given to you so that you can know exactly what is going on be alert and vigilant at all time there's something that's coming towards you that's a secret so the universe or your ancestors may not be re uh, revealing this to you and it has someone living in fear this could be a queen of wands that's living in fear because you will be having some type of offer and it's going to be balanced out to you. If someone stole something from you, it will be returned back to you. Um, because someone is being seen as a clown, 
when I say a clown, someone is being seen as a clown, someone is being seen as uh just malicious, uh, just disingenuine because someone has been pretending for a long time to be the architect of something or pretending to be genuine, to pretending to be, uh, I don't they say gifted, pretending to be gifted, talented, skilled, whatever this is, but the truth is out, okay? And she's living in fear because this is what this woman has been trying to prevent you from happening, you having a new beginning, having, being hopeful, stepping out on faith, being afraid for the truth to come out, but it's out. Being afraid for you to connect with your soul tribe, being in a community that supports you, but it's happening. Being afraid of you being um, self-master, okay? You being in control of a situation, but it is, that's, that's what's going on. You being seen as wish fulfillment, you being seen as a healer, that's what's going on. You being seen as a, as a queen of pentacles, baby, that's what's going on. Minding your business, improving, learning, you know, taking care of the home front, being the ideal woman and things like that in your own life. Not because you want a masculine to see you that way, because these kind of women that I'm picking up on, they take on a persona so that, that a man can see them in a certain light. And you know, you can you can pretend... You can fix the funk as long as you want to. The truth is always going to come out because that's how the universe has it set up. It's not because someone is being malicious towards you. It's because that's how the natural order of things are set up. The truth is always going to be exposed. So you are a queen of pentacles. You will have wish fulfillment. You are very content. People may be trying to dismantle your stability, your self-sufficiency, your independence, your finances basically dismantle your foundation but the universe wants you to walk out here in confidence with your head up because they will be restoring what it is anyone to try to take from you or whatever anyone took from you it will be returned to you 10 times full uh yeah i said 10 times full in the wheel of fortune things will be balanced out for you in divine timing so you just keep learning keep manifesting everything will be returned to you uh there are people in a specific community that are about to go through some really horrible karma uh and it's going to be really something nothing short of a nightmare because this is how hard yeah this is how hard these people were going out the rituals the manipulations the lie the deceit causing confusions and all kinds of stuff trying to change your destiny you cannot change destiny you some of you have had like hitting enemies around you and you don't even know some of you these are like your family members friends co-workers that are hitting enemies being paid bribe behind the scenes to do you something in order to block you from being able to have your ten of pentacles but your ancestors have been all over this situation now a whole family is bonded in some type of court case that's about to take place and it's going to end up leading to them losing everything they may have been trying to trap a, 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 a emperor in some type of court case but he has foresight of what has been going on he also knows who it is he wants to work with so this emperor will be moving on and it has people burdened he's going to be moving on to give his offer to whoever it is that he wants someone could be out here paying um a malicious character behind the scenes to cause blockages for someone else um as far as you maybe even receiving a promotion you elevating in life in whatever way that's destined to you um someone is out here paying someone to do it Okay, so if you have either like a promotion at work, they're paying someone to not give you that promotion. If you apply for a position, they're paying someone not to give you that uh, position. If you have a business, they're doing something behind the scenes so that your business is not flourishing. If you have a platform, they're paying someone to make sure that your platform is either crashing, it's not growing, numbers are stagnant and things like that. All of that is going to be balanced out. Someone out here, I don't know if this is like a Sagittarius woman, man, or whatever. They received some really bad news that they may have overindulged in something and it's backfiring. There is no like teamwork in any in, in a in a community. I don't know what it is these people have been uh, invested in, but it is backfire horribly. Um, this whole community is about to be dismantled. Someone is about, I'm telling you, it's about to be dismantled. Whatever relationship this has to do with, it's about to be dismantled. There could be some type of really horrible divorce that's about to take place or it's going on. There could be a masculine that may have invested or poured into the wrong person in the past. Now he may want to come in, give you some type of offer to balance things out so that this chapter can be successfully ended or closed or whatever. May want to have closure with you as well. It's been a whole lot going on folks but you know the universe is all over it someone may be uh you know someone is trying to to control a situation but it's like everything that they are seeing being told is that they cannot they don't have control over a situation the universe is letting someone know we are in charge you don't have 
a hand in this situation. And the longer you try to hold on to something, the worse we're going to make your life. We're going to make your life so miserable. By the time all of this is over, you're going to regret every action you ever took. And there could be a Queen of Cups reverse that's going through this right now, having a lot of regrets. Why did she do something she did? She should have never done something. She should have never taken some type of action. She should have never told some type of lie. Lies. She have never gone to the extent of manipulating everybody in a community about someone or whatever the situation is this woman is going through it we have the freaking four of pentacles around her the three of swords the uh, uh eight of swords the freaking seven of wands in the reverse with the ten of cups everything is falling apart in this woman's life whatever relationship she was in is over it's not something that's based on uh, a genuine nature this is that one of those superficial relationships where you get into because you know there are certain people in a level of society in certain social classes they get into relationships because of the look of it He's from a millionaire family. I'm from a millionaire family. Uh, she's light-skinned. She's Caucasian. She's whatever. And you know it's acceptable in this society. So that's who I'm going to get with. It's something like that. But a masculine may not want to be in a superficial relationship anymore. He doesn't want to be in a relationship that's just for the appearance. Because there's some type of misery that he's going through behind the scenes. And he's putting an end to it. This will be why there's seven of... Seven of Wands in the reverse is here because this is a superficial relationship and it's coming to an end. It has no grounds. It's not something that's respectable. There's no love. There's no reciprocity. There's no wish fulfillment. Uh, there's some type of horrible separation that's going on. It may be like a divorce or just two people separating, whatever this is. But it's all for the betterment of a situation. Did I just hit my light? Excuse me. Um, I had mistakenly hit my... um. Uh, uh, ring light, excuse me. <laughs> yeah, something, did you guys see that? That, that? That's a sign. Something is done. Someone is going through a dark night of the soul. Their life, like, is being dismantled by the spirit realm because someone was warned not to do something. They may have been stealing energy, just manipulating around them, and the spirit realm has been warning someone for a long time, and they didn't listen. So now they're taking actions, they're taking matters into their own hand and giving this woman a taste of her own medicine. Um, there's something being reviewed though, a plot. I don't know who they were plotting against. It could be you, the masculine, but they're plotting on someone. Um, you may have even like a, a, a someone that was supposed to be genuine and has fallen from grace. You may have someone that is not in the upright and is receiving some type of bad news. I don't know if this was a higher level soulmate at some point or soulmate at some point that has fallen from grace and they're receiving some type of really bad news. Okay. Um, so anyways, that is the read for now. I will see you in my next tarot reading. Thank you for watching and supporting the channel as always. Stay blessed. I'll see you in my next read. Goodbye for now.